Oh shit. What is it, boss? Listen to this. Lakeville College's administration and faculty have decided to cut the following school programs. The drama department, music department, knitting club, and the school newspaper. Shit, does that swallow? That's what I just said. I was just checking. Does it say anything else? Just that it was to save money and that it was a unanimous vote. Oh, shocker. Has this school ever made a decision that wasn't unanimous? No. Well, my last article for the year is going to be good. <laughs> what is it? Fifth missing student this year. Damn. What's yours about? Well, I was writing up an interview about that fat-ass mouse in the diner, but... Oh, who'd you interview for that? The mouse. What do you say? Nothing. Oh, okay. But seriously, I, I think I'm gonna cut it. I wanna dig deeper into why every decision the school ever makes is unanimous. I think there's blackmail involved. Blackmail? Hi, uh, is this the Lakeville Times office? Yeah, why? Oh, my name's Joe. I'm the president of the chapter of Alpha Zeta Gamma. Alpha Zeta Gamma? Uh huh. Um, I really need your help with something. I can't really talk right now. I'm so sorry. I have to go set up for the stupid philanthropy event. But I feel like something's really wrong. You feel like something's wrong? Well, I've been seeing that you're doing all of these articles about all of the missing students, and the school's aura is such a deep shade of black that my sorority psychic, Rosalinda, she had to be hospitalized because of it. What? Can you please just tell us what you need? I think there's something suspicious about those students. How come? Well, they've all gone missing after they've spoken out against administration and everything that's going on in the school. So I think they're being disposed of. I don't know. First was Brady, the football player. Do you owe this victory to Lakeville College? Hell no. They never did anything for me. <laughs> then there was Casper, the SoundCloud rapper. Lakeville bitch, more like Elville bitch. You're so fucking right. I think they're the school's getting rid of them somehow. So, what are you thinking, boss? I don't know. Well, you know, she seems a little cuckoo to me, so... Pause. Pausing. I'm thinking. We could use her. On pause. How so? I mean, the administration always goes to their events. What does that even mean? I have my heart set on getting into the administration building. <laughs> so fucking true. We'll help with the... We'll help with the missing people. But first, you have to help us. Sure thing. So at tonight's event, give the president's keys. I'm the president. No, the president of the college's keys. Dr. Myers. Oh, okay. And then, we'll break into their secret little office and see what they're hiding. Hiding? We'll explain later. Do I leave now? Please. Yes. I don't know, Joe. Why the hell are we in a lecture hall? It's the only space they had. It's a small school. I did what I could. Well, it's gonna be a little hard to mingle in here with all these seats. It's better than nothing. What the fuck is this? Well, Rosalinda was supposed to get all the decorations, so I had to improvise and get stuff from the drama department. Where is she? Who knows? Last I heard, she was having a meeting with Dr. Myers and she came back all weird yet last night. I don't know. Why was she having a meeting with Dr. Myers? I don't know everything. God. I don't know. I was in the meeting with the president. He was mad. And now I'm here. Why were you in a meeting with the president? I sensed something was wrong. I needed to find out. You don't look so good. I think you should go home. Girls, uh, can you come bring her home?
you good? It's the new missing student. Anything weird about it? I don't think so. That's Rosalinda. Did you know her? Didn't Joe mention Rosalinda earlier today? Oh, shit, you're right, she did. Maybe she's not so crazy after all. Guess we'll find out tonight, boss. All right, ladies, we've got a great event lined up today. Remember, five Bs, four Bs today. Boys, booze, Bible, Biden. Don't talk about them. And what do we need to remember to do? Milk their money. Indeed. All right, can anybody start setting up the music while you're on the from guests? Dr. Myers, it's so good to see you. You're not normally out of your office. Of course, it was for a good cause. Well, and I've had some time. Well, thank you so much. Oh, um, speaking of good causes or good things, I heard you're cutting the school newspaper. Screw those pesky little writers, am I right? <laughs> right. I'm only trying to do what's best for Lakeville, as usual. Of course. <laughs> <clears throat> Are you okay? Uh, I'm feeling a little sick, to be honest. Oh, well then, would you like to make your donation now? Yes, right. Here. I'm so sorry, we only take cash. Right. Well, I, I have some in my wallet, but I'll have to go out to my car. Oh, no worries, I can go out and get it for you. That's very kind of you. It's no problem. This is all just strange co co coincidences? Coincid coincidences? Coincidences. Like, what if we're looking into it too much? I mean, we could be connecting dots that aren't even there. I mean, we could be, but what if there really is something that needs to be discovered? This isn't just another burst pipe in the performing arts wing or like another rotten food in the diner. Well, there's a lot of that. Yeah. I mean, disappearances of people who made the school look bad, that's something worth reporting. Willow. I got it, bitches! Hell yeah, you did! Can we just go in now? I've been dying to find out what they're hiding in there. Can we, can we, can we, can we? Not yet. We need to wait a little bit. Make sure they're all out of the building. Oh. I told the girls to distract Mr. Myers for as long as they could, so I'm sure he's gonna go home right after. Hell yeah, see? Joe, did you mention a Rosalinda earlier today? Oh my god, yeah, she stopped by earlier. Wait, what? I mean, she looked half dead, so I asked some of the girls to take her home. She had a meeting with Mr. Myers or something she kept talking about. Dude. Holy shit, but I just saw her today. But you said it didn't seem like she was all right. No, not at all. Dude, I think this is something worth reporting, right? What do you guys think is going on? Can't say until we see what's inside that building. Well, let's go. We need to wait. You know, there was a time when I was going to join the newspaper. Really? Well, why didn't you? I had too much going on. So why'd you join Alpha Zeta in the first place? I think I just needed somewhere to belong. I mean, I know it sounds silly and corny, the whole like, sisterhood, all these girls will be in the bridesmaids at your wedding, but I found a real sisterhood there. Something really special. Yeah, I could see that. I mean, I think we've just got a really great community. That's sweet. How about you guys? Why do you do what you do? The newspaper? Well, I mean, I guess for the same reason. You know, I had a lot of rage issues I needed to work through. It seemed interesting enough. Really? Yeah, I fell in love with writing. I mean, we're not making up stories out of thin air, but we're taking things that really did happen and telling people about them. Yeah, I mean, without us, no one would even know what's going on around campus. I mean, Everything's so hush-hush, they sweep everything under the rug. We do the dirty work. Yeah, I mean, I think it's the most important thing you could do with this tiny-ass school.
just think it's late enough now? It's literally late. Yeah, sure. I don't think anyone's here, boss. Oh wow, Joe, you really knew him. Damn. That's Brady. Dear Dr. Myers, my name is Rosalinda. I'm a part of Alpha Gamma Zeta. Holy shit. What? I have noticed some connections between the negative energy of this school and the amount of missing students. Can we please plan to meet on this? I also want to talk to our school newspaper about this. When did she send this? No, look at this one. It's an email to the vice principal from Meyer. It says, Dr. Smith, I'm worried some students may be on to us, especially the newspaper and the sorority need to do something about it. Me. No that shit, me. Sherlock. Yo, okay, this is bad. This is really, really like missing people and shit. And then now they have pictures. Why the fuck do they even have pictures of us? And why are the emails printed? I wonder. What? 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 I wonder how long we've been on their minds. Uh, uh, we we gotta go. I can't. This is no. We no, go. we still have more no. we need to find. No, I can't do this. No, I'm gonna pass out. So. I'm gonna go. You guys take care of this. Why don't we go get you some water? Yeah. It's okay. It's gonna be fine. Mama. Yeah, it is. It's it's gonna no. be fine. It'll be fine. We'll just get you some water and we'll be okay. Maybe there's something jammed. That shit looks expired. It's glowing. Look, it's glowing. It's glowing. The fuck? What the fuck? Store. It shouldn't be out for that how long. How do you think, like, how long do you think it's been out of the fridge? I don't even want to think about that. It's gonna make me gag. What are you doing? Evidence. Obviously, it's vampires. What the fuck? No, you're saying. Because they're vampires and they drink blood. I mean, Rosalinda, she figured out something was wrong and poof, they had to dispose of her. Same with Brady and that SoundCloud guy. I mean, we never see the administration outside of the building when it's bright and sunny and Dr. Myers is like 50, but somehow he looks. 19, and don't forget the similarities between all of the programs that got cut. What are you talking about? Drama department just did Dracula. The music department only sings songs from Twilight. And the knitting, knitting club? club? Needles. And us, they knew we were gonna figure it out eventually, so they needed to get rid of us before we figured it out. It all makes perfect sense. Why does the faculty agree with everything the administration says? It's not blackmail, it's hypnosis. I mean, you look a vampire in the eye and boom, you do everything they say. Okay, boss, you're on your own because this sounds fucking insane. Are you joking? It makes perfect sense. No, it doesn't. Fine, if you guys don't agree with me, then I'll go to the bottoms of the earth to find Dr. Meyer's coffin if I have to. What the fuck? Absolutely 
not. That's a coffin. Oh shit. What are you doing? I'm taking a picture. Why would you do that? It's a vampire. Holy this is a shit. Holy shit. This is a show. 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 No, this is a. They saw us. No, I don't think so. <laughs> oh, my God, oh my God, oh my God, oh my God! Go faster! Oh, I'm going oh, faster! Oh, oh, my God! Oh, my God. Oh, shit. I'm a nervous driver, stop! Oh, my God! Oh, my God! Oh, my God! Oh, my God. Oh, my God. Stop, stop. Go faster. I'm going, oh, my God. Oh, my God, screw you, vampire freak. Vampires are real. They might be. Oh shit! Oh my god! 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 Oh my god. 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 Actually, fucking work. Oh, oh, my oh, my oh my god. Good idea. Oh <laughs> Said <to> my friend. <laughs> Nothing else matters. everything for us. Oh, well, it looks good. Yeah, now turn right. off the lights. Yes, shut. What are you doing? Writing this damn article before Meyer's ass bursts in here and takes my neck for a Capri Sun. Well, what can we do? Just make sure he doesn't get in here for the next hour. Uh, Layla, do you have any vampire repelly things? Why would we... Wait. Chimmy Alfredo with garlic. It'll keep us safe. You really think that'll work? Yeah, I saw it on Fright Night. Shit! Do something. Sing. Um, just like the white winged dove sings a song, sounds like she's singing. Ooh, baby, ooh. And ooh. I don't get the whole Stevie Nicks thing. She has a song called Vampire's Dream that probably pissed him off. She released a whole album based off of one of the Twilight movies. Plus, she's totally witchy. Aren't you such a Stevie Nicks fan? What are you gonna tell us? You're on Stevie Nicks stand Twitter next? Maybe. What is she even gonna do with that when it's done? Well, I don't really know because we can't officially print the paper, so I guess she's just gonna... Print it normally and put it all up over the school like a flyer. Oh. If we even live to see tomorrow. <laughs> yeah. Come on, let's go. Let's go. 
Come on, I've got an idea. You guys have a fucking radio station? Is that the most shocking discovery you have made today? Get the fuck up, Lakeville listeners! We're doing something really special for you guys tonight. Who is ready for the greatest Stevie Nicks slash Fleetwood Mac marathon of all time? You're a genius. I know. Here's The Chain by Fleetwood Mac. Open the window. Garbage can. But what if there's something under there? Like, what if it fucking but, mouse? But what if it like turned into a bat? I don't know, man! <laughs> Shit, boss, he almost got you. Brady? That's Brady? You have done. We have to go now. We have to put them up. We're two! I have an idea. Okay. Sorry, Brady! Too long to explain. You two keep Dr. Myers distracted, and I'm gonna run down to the lecture. No, we should not split up. This horror movie 101. What the fuck is wrong with her? I don't know. Come and get me, Dr. Myers. The shittiest excuse for a president. Hello. Relax. I've got protection. What? Yeah. What? I saw you guys do it earlier, and I didn't know if it would work, but it did. That's because I'm the smart one. Is it warm? I'm kind of hungry though. No, okay. But that it worked because I'm the smart one. Between us, I'm the smart one. I I don't know about that. Okay. Honey, with the flyers? Yeah, I guess. Shouldn't we wait for Joe, though? No, let her focus on what she's doing and we'll focus on what we're doing. Okay. Do you want me to say Stevie next? No, just be quiet. Okay. Holy shit! Oh my god. Those are the, like, original pharmacy students, right? You can't look them in the eye. What? Hand me the papers, Willow. Willow? You don't want to end up like Rosalinda did for digging around too much, now do you?
Lovely Stevie Mix. That's genius. How did you even figure that out? I'm home and it's done. Duh. Y'all, after every other major got cut. She's a girl that's... Dr. Myers behind you! Don't even try, it's a mess. In a few hours, everyone's gonna know the truth about you. Also, not liking good music is your weakness. The fuck is wrong with you? I mean, it's what he deserves for turning Brady. And not liking Stevie Nicks. And for not supporting his students and silencing those who stand up to him. Okay, relax. What are you, a poli sci major now? So honestly, this has been kind of fun. I agree, for the most part, I had fun. I am so glad that you guys are having fun, but this made me want to take up smoking. Should you always have these on you? Yeah, well, there's a lot of smokers on campus and they make them bump cigarettes off me for money. <laughs> I'm in my bag. I mean, well, I hope you're proud of yourself. Like, you definitely saved some lives. I hope so.